So Riapele is a joint venture that uh, Conlog has started with Chimulakong in order to uh, extend our research capability into the greater community of South Africa by building up and creating technical talent and enabling entrepreneurship. So the innovation challenge was to look at how we could implement blockchain into our products and solutions within Conlog. And Conlog has been quite progressive in leading the way in partnering with Chimulukung to make sure that we understand the capabilities of the technology and how it applies in smart metering systems. We had a uh, innovation gap in our business um, and we believe that the African solutions that we offer uh, should be designed by Africans. To take R&D of a, a billion, billion rand JC listed company and put it in a tech incubator where you're allowing startups, where you're allowing young technologists to start innovating and, and bringing in their fresh ideas and fresh ways of thinking to create a solution that you're going to take to market, that is something quite special. Bringing together young minds, creative ideas, thoughts and, and, and aligning it to uh, an industry program um, and exposing these minds to what's happening in the industry and having uh, my business understand um, how these minds are working today. The innovation challenge focuses around uh, a few topics. The two major is around blockchain technology and fintech and around uh, communication. So communication between uh, a meter and um, what we refer to as a back-end system. Those two problems were presented as problem statements and given to the team which then uh, went out and came up with some real, real innovative solutions around how, how to solve those problems. The impact the Riapele program will make on the, in the industry is that uh, with the introduction of blockchain you have a new technology that is safe and secure that will ensure user information uh, is kept private, which is one of the biggest challenges within the smart metering industry. And it will also facilitate a different mechanism for financial transaction payments. Not only are we enabling young people access to knowledge and decision makers, but we're also reinforcing the belief that entrepreneurship does work in South Africa if you have the right mix and the right attitude but also the required supporting team. One of the wonderful things that I've been able to observe in a very short amount of time about the entrepreneurs is that they've become quite mature in a short space of time with everything they've learned during the program, particularly the blockchain training and understanding the technology. They are seeing a world you know, right in front of them that will be enabled by this blockchain technology and they're already talking to the multitude of problems that they can together as a team solve. I work with a great team, like these guys are awesome what they do. So we've become this co-existing team, um, bringing different skills, background to the project and making it a success. Some of the reasons for joining the Peter program was basically about exploring the whole uh, blockchain side of implementing use cases that actually have an impact in society. I was really gr glad to actually implement um, this new technology that can actually uh, take me into the future. and create my future, create my world. So what next? What is next is that we're going to have to continue the engagement in terms of what, how do we take this, what you guys have created, refine it, make sure that it, it, is, it is really specific and it's designed for a particular market segment and then grow from there. The positive for me is that this is just the beginning, such a point. You know, this, is, this is only just the launch pad for us. There's more to aim for, basically the sky's the limit.